It's right, right here right now, again, on the corner of Centennial and Marietta. And there was a huge crowd here, in it, but as we've seen it several times over the past few days, that crowds tend to break off and they tend to march in different directions. You know, you look to the left, or, or my left, that is, and you'll see, you know, there is a crowd over there. You'll see National Guardsmen that are in there talking uh, to the crowd right now. You even look to the right, same thing that is happening right now. There's a couple of National Guardsmen that have been talking with a few protesters that are out here. And so... You, Earlier today, um, we right when we got here, out here around 4 o'clock, a drum line decided that they wanted to come out to entertain the crowd. They had been seeing, you know, a lot of the tension from from days ago, but, you know, they noticed that as the, the protests continue, that they want to continue to keep everyone's spirits lifted. So they came out here. They're actually called Black Lives Matter Drum Line. It's just a bunch of drummers who got together and decided to do that. And uh, I was able to talk to Pastor Troy. He was out here earlier today with them. And I talked to him, and he told me how he's been out here every day and how that vibe's kind of changed. Just beautiful to see how the environment's done changed from Friday night to now. As you see, it's a peaceful atmosphere, children out here and everything, man. It's a beautiful thing, man. Y'all, let's keep it up, man. Keep the pressure on. For, looking for a new day in America. And speaking of something that's also different, if you look across the street, normally about this time, we normally see a police line, a National Guard uh, line as well, on right there by those fences, and the protesters are talking to uh, the police. That's not happening right now. The police are actually further back towards the CNN Center there, um, and nobody's kind of gathered around that area. So we haven't seen that at all today. We've been here a couple of hours now. But the uh, the curfew is an hour earlier. It is uh, in two hours. So we're going to see how things progress as, as people tend to come back to Centennial Olympic Park here in the next hour or so. And, of course, we'll keep you updated with all of those uh, developments. Sir.